Uh, Roisin, what do you feel about people's perception of young people and how they've dealt with the pandemic? We, we discussed this a lot on the show yesterday. We were talking about the video from Berlin D2 and how we spoke to a lot of young people who feel that, you know, that age group have been unnecessarily targeted and uh, sort of branded with this, like, you know, you're not following the rules, you're not doing your part, you're not pulling together. Do you get a sense of that? Yeah, absolutely. I think that people see, and this is the sense I get is that people see socialising, going out to pubs and bars or having people over to the house has been a bit frivolous and the attitude is almost like, well, you can live without that for a year. I mean, listen, if you go out, you're going to maybe be you know, like those pictures in Berlin Bar, not social distancing, not going by the rules. But actually, there's a huge amount of young people that want to be able to see friends, that want to be able to socialise, that need that so that they have uh, social connections in their life um, and that are obeying, you know, they are prepared to have three or four people to the house, but they're being kind of brushed with this, well, you're having a house party, you're not social distancing if you're in a bar. Um, so I think it's been very unfair and it's kind of... Uh, if you have a house uh, and you're maybe an older or a later period of your life and you have family around you, then maybe you don't feel the need to go out socialising as much. But people have to respect that at a different earlier stage of your life, people need that to keep their self well, to keep them mentally happy.